think the most exciting thing that's uh, happened to both commercial radio and to Bauer is this migration of audiences onto digital platforms. All digital platforms are important, but I think DAB is spectacularly important to the fact that we can now enable our consumers to enter a broader ecosystem for each of our brands and spend more time engaging with our brands. I think it's a fantastic uh, period of innovation across radio. I mean, you take from the industry side of things, uh, most recently the latest set of radars where commercial radio actually beat the BBC in reach for the first time in this millennium. So an amazing achievement across commercial radio. I think the creation of DAX has been a really incredible moment. It's going from strength to strength and it's really going to be quite transformative for the industry going forward. The demise of radio has been forecast so many times and actually we're in rude health at the moment. More choice than ever before, the exciting launch of D2. Um, radio being able to get into people's lives in an even more impressive way than before so that there are real opportunities for advertisers and a fantastic service for listeners. The explosion of new stations has been incredibly exciting. I think at a national and local level we've seen a range of new stations with loads of different formats targeting every listener. It's just great to see that consumers, customers and agencies are excited about the medium again and I think that's been created by further investment in national brands, in new brands, in uh, technology, in new talent coming to the industry, brand extensions, etc., which just create uh, a far, far more vibrant field for the sector. The most exciting developments have been all around the creation of the new brands. Um, you only have to look at the success which Heart, Capital and Smooth has had over the last few years. It's exactly this creation of new radio brands combined with great personalities which will continue to grow the market share which commercial radio has. Well for commercial radio generally I think the last set of radio figures was fantastic because total commercial listening uh, outweighs BBC and I think that's a great story for, for commercial radio. And the second thing for us, for us as a KMFM um, we've been watching the small scale DAB trials and obviously they seem to be going, going well uh, the trial's been extended, but we think that is a potential solution for us, for our audiences, um, to be able to engage more people at a very local level in Kent uh, with our with KMFM stations.